Hey, welcome or welcome back to the channel today. We're finally cracking into season six of The Expanse. This is the first episode entitled Strange Dogs. Thoughts on the last episode whew, are back there. Thoughts on that episode on that season, I'm going to leave them there. I think both were solid. But going forward into the season, the, the only thing of note I want to mention is that when Babbage and the uh, captain or the admiral from Mars went through the gate and got all messed up, before that happened, they had mentioned, I think it was like an Admiral Duarte, or th there was another person like above them because the admiral was saying, Admiral Duarte gives whatever to your, whatever to you, Marco. So it's like, there, there's, even if those people got diced at the gate, there's still someone out there for, uh, for everyone to pursue. And I guess this season is going to be about ending Marco, stopping the proto molecule, and probably breaking up Mars and the belt. What that means for the show, the universe as a whole going forward, I don't know because even though this is the end of the show i know there are more books more material that go out further into the universe with a bit of a time jump i think last season they could do anything they could kill anyone they could bring back people they could they could do whatever they want to do you know and uh i trust them it's been it's been a ride there's only five or six episodes this last season, and they're all like 45 minutes, except I think the last episode. As long as the writing, the acting, the execution, as long as everything has been as good as it's been, I trust them. This is actually the second uh, intro take I've done for this video. The first one was five or six minutes of just sputtering, <laughs> rambling mess. I just woke up uh, filming this in the morning. It's not ideal, but it is what it is. Caffeine will guide me i was gonna say aid me but no it is it is the whole guide i'm kind of curious about what the overall theme will be for the season because you know season four had the frontier feel and the out west and lawlessness and you know staking claims and that whole feel five was just like major political shifts between marcos hitting earth with rocks and then getting all this martian tech and it, the ball has been rolling for a long time, though. Bobby's been investigating following the stealth tech that was used on the meteors. Okay, I've been rambling for about four minutes. This intro take has been smooth. haven't had to redo anything, so feels good. So yeah, I'm not going to waste any more time. Just going to get into it. This is the first episode of Season 6 of The Expanse, Strange Dogs. Here we go. Cold open. I thought we were gonna get intro after the previously on. Are we on a planet or? Send babies. Little dragon chicks, chicklings. Mommy, I found something. Is this a young character that we know, or is this someone new? Is that you? What are you? Like a dick boar, okay. dickhead. I don't trust those eyes. They're trying to tell you something. Get away from it. It's, okay. it's like an eco dome or something. Like what? What are we? God damn! Ring six seven three planet two. Okay. Laconia. Here we go with these credits. Frankie! Damn. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the fuck? I thought only a couple hit originally. Is this a... I can't tell if they're hitting... Like that guy from season up. one. He was yelling at a uh, detective Miller. The combined railgun barrage destroyed the three incoming rocks. Total casualties under 500. Don't try to make it sound like a success. Million spared. <laughs> Mars has assured us there will be one more Donager class operational within the month. And we'll have three the more. Don. Ready for Yo, the Don. Yo, from season one. The yards are working around the clock. That was the flagship of the fucking Martian Navy, and they got smoked by those ships in season one. I'm loving the the grain farm. 
I'm loving so far. It's only been on like five minutes, but we've connected to season one a few times. It's like a goddamn nuclear winter. Repurposing our atmospheric CO2 scrubbers isn't working. Meteoric contaminants are still rising. Even faster than before. Is Earth gonna have to vacate? Every rock kills us a little more. Are we doing sins or are we in real combat? Contact? It's murder. Well, I guess that confirms the rumors of free Navy activity in this area. Is Bull not here? Are they just not giving him screen time? Do you think I could convince Chrissy to pay us for every one of these assholes we take out? A bounty? A commission? A kill bounty? We're not mercenaries. We're not soldiers either. Boy, a little skiff like that could have launched rocks this big. They're doing the micrometeers, which is a smart no. move. Pages, you still alive? If you call this living. You want to go back to jail? Like a series of transient spice trip the surge protectors? You took the words right out of my mouth. She does have some technical sure aptitude, that's true. Uh, a legitimate salvage. Yeah, I kind of wish they would have recast Alex instead of kill him off, but I guess maybe it was boots too big to fill. You know, it would be someone just trying to imitate him and they didn't want that. Uh oh, we got a facility or a ship? God damn it, there's another ship down there. I don't think that is a ship. It's a drive. Oh, they're pushing the fucking bitch. <laughs> yep. Yeah. I was gonna say, what's the Martian ship doing there? But oh yeah, the Alliance. <laughs> he had a lot of mixed emotions, expressions there. They're too busy trying to knock down our rocks. Yes, which gives us the perfect opportunity to build up our own supply. Dawes always Dawes said that... is dead because I got tired of listening to what he had to say. What the that fuck? You killed Dawes off camera? Say. Was that established last season? I don't think so. You want something? I do. I mean to Jake. That's not all you mean. Let me know if you change your mind. He's not paying attention fucking at all. Good news. Solano has taken the last of Ariaga's ship and spaced the crew. We can up the bounty. More money? Is that the best you can do? Increase the bounty on Joma 20%. And the Rosinante as well. Just open fucking bounties so anyone in the Free Navy, any belter, can make a move. So you may have no taste, but they do. I tell them we can arrange for a tour to Pella. <laughs> I have always considered this station to be a home. And now we will turn it into the jewel it was always meant to be. Ceres will be the capital city of our Belter nation. Is everything fallen to the Belters and Marcos? Is it all just like there's Earth and there's Mars and then everything else is his? The drummer is still... Careful, are they gonna clip? Careful, why am I leaning? Okay, I thought they were gonna hit. Fuck you, man. Prepare to be boarded. Tyler, we know you here also. Show and declare yourself or be destroyed. Is drummer setting traps? <laughs> Bait? Take the shot. Not yet. It's a direct fire weapon. It has to line up perfectly. Oh, they're using the rail gun on him? On my signal. No! <laughs> what did you do? Test. Quick and dirty. Any rock copper with a standard mining kit could do this. The trigger module will probably be with the guidance system. Naomi is a genius, as proven uh, throughout the whole show, especially when she was stuck on the ship. I just realized this is the first time I've flown the Rosie. First time I ever had to. Copy that. <laughs> the heads-up display is highlighting what he needs to do. You've started the reactor. Unless a trip to fail so you need to get out of there. Ah, shit. <laughs> did, did he trigger a fail-safe, or was it just time for it to go, or did someone push a button on it? So, long story short, the power coupling is back in spec. Good work. Good teacher. 
is Naomi protective of Amos or not trusting of Peaches or jealous of the kinship or, you know, I thought she'd enjoy a fellow engineer or, you know, technician. Is there something you need Peaches to do differently? I don't really care what she does. The only reason she's here is because you decided to make her part of the crew. As if that could replace Alex. That's not what, why he did it. He didn't know Alex was dead when he was palling around with her. But maybe you could cut Peaches a fucking break like we all did for you. I don't know if I quite understand or agree with the friction between them right now. We need to refuel. We need to re -arm. We're going to talk about the other problem. Michio is not a problem. It's not her first mistake. She was fucking up with their trigger finger. She's a salvage technician. So are you. Not anymore. I'm a fighter now. This is not a place for her anymore. Combat readiness, though, you can't have a liability in a combat scenario. This can be shared. A little crowded, maybe, but we will make do. Give us a moment, please. I got it. Oh, new joins or transfers. Spies! Everyone's a spy. I will do better. I promise. I try harder. You are trying your best. No one questions that. She's just too frantic. She needs to I'm smoke sorry. a little and I'm relax. Sorry to a place where you can stay. No, I don't want to leave you. It isn't forever. When it is over. Season uh, episode six. I just want a picture to go with the words. <laughs> that's all. Really, that's all you want. They moved quick on those two girls. <laughs> but hey, Philip, you was the tip of the spear. Took stuff composite right off Mars itself. Right under the noses of the dusters. Right in front of Bobby. Wow, you're a mass murderer. That's so hot. He's got an obvious conflict going on here. And if his friend is smooth, he might be able to parlay a three-way. We owe these people nothing. Cities is our capital. These are our people. Your job is to get them what they need. Each of these signals launched a rock. Which gave me another idea. I triangulated the signals to see if I could find out where the transmission came from. Someone in like an orbit. Yeah, yeah. Probably a spot ship. If we could find it, that would cripple. Take it out, it that could seriously reduce his yeah. ability to keep hitting Earth. Ugh, me. There's no time to talk about anything. I wanted to talk about Philip and Marco in the last scene, and then I want to talk about what they just that learned. And now they're talking. There's no time. For me to get through <clears throat> There's no here. time. I tried for so long to stay away from the violence, but Marco pulled me back into it. She and seems a little depleted, home. like a little and sunken. Is she all right? I don't know how much longer I can bear it. The colonies have been incommunicado and at the mercy of the Free Navy since Anaros wiped out our forces at the ring. The one thing I always liked about you is you kind of suck at lying. <laughs> uh, Bobby. I know who you are. So, let's go then. <laughs> so let's go. This all it takes uh, with your other girls. Fucking lucky I'm even talking to someone like you. Oh, really? Pompous little shit. Yeah. Hey, DC, I'm your friend. No, you're a fucking joke. The fuck on into you. You're fucking serious. I was gonna say, we're Phillips in self destruction mode, and then he killed his friend seconds later. Is he gonna realize, like, that's what he did um, to millions of people? I never thought I'd actually enjoy this sensation. I can come back if you like. <laughs> no. You hate this job. Yes, ma'am. Put her on the Rosinante. Put her on the Rossi! Your problem is that you're a Marine. You're sick of doing nothing. I just received word from Holden. He believes they've located an Inaros spot ship. I was wondering if they were going to get that intel back to her. It to makes sense. They See if they're right. Yes, she, they are. She, stay out there. That would be good. Yes! Fuck good. Little wins here and there will not hold us together. You have something in mind? I do. I'd say all we need now is Prax Meng to come back, get everyone back together, but... But I like him being safe away from the action. Oh yeah, I also gotta do the x-ray stuff, right? Oh, we did find one more rack of fuel pellets from Doho. Container was mislabeled. Good news, I'll take it. I'm okay, wondering if this takes wall. place before the episode that we just watched same time or after. I know they're talking about the DeWalt. 
after because it showed the bounty up on them and the Rossi. I wonder if these are deleted scenes, deleted footage. They're like, what, can we do something with this? Chama's private log. I broke into it and opened it. Meet you. I put a hand terminal back where it was. I'm particular, like I'll put stuff down at an angle on purpose just to come back and see if it's been put down straight and shit. I, I... Oh, and I couldn't tell that that was Naomi, my goodness. They were all like that. All of her. Nothing of Oksana, or Bertolt, or such. Nothing of us. I knew if they were together, I knew they meant a bunch to each other, but I realized she'd be pining over Naomi. Quietly. Kamina doesn't love us. She's chasing the one she couldn't have and making do with us. How can- We are all flawed! Yeah, you suck at your job, lady. That's why you're getting the boot. I wonder what's gonna happen next episode <laughs> that without this information would change my perception of what's happening. Oh, delete though. Okay, so she's letting go, but her crew thinks she's still on the hook with Naomi. That was cool. That was fun. I'm glad I watched this. Going to the outro now, for real. Strange dogs. The tensions of war threaten to pull the Rasanante crew apart when they make a startling discovery on an asteroid. Avasarala and Bobby contend with the devastation on Earth as Marco's rocks continue to rain down. In the belt and on the run, Drummer and her family must make a heartbreaking decision on... And then it's cut off. Is there more? Is it a... On series, Marco and Philip struggles turn inward. Okay. I, like, I'm blown away at how non-stop... A lot happened in that first episode. A lot fucking happened. Like, Earth is getting pelted. Our crew, everyone on the crew looks like weary and, and depleted and worn out and, you know, unmotivated. And that kind of went against the speech that I think Avasarala might have been making earlier. I don't I don't even know where to begin. Philip is on this self-destruction path. I don't know if he's second guessing and guilt creeping in and he's now lashing out and getting drunk and fuck he capped his friend at the bar. So as always there are multiple parties kind of working this problem. The Rossi crew discovering that on the asteroid and you know learning getting that information back to Christian and that's gonna, I believe, now get Bobby back with the crew, it sounds like, so I'm I'm all about it. More Bobby Draper, please. More drummer, please. No, I, I, I understand not wanting to let that crew member go that's underperforming, but uh, we're in a combat scenario, and if your shit isn't locked down tight, you're, you're a liability, you're a risk to everyone around you, and you need to you need to be somewhere else. So I 100% agree with that decision. Like, there's reality, and then there's loyalty, and, you know, loyalty will <laughs> only get you so far, and the reality is she's gonna fuck things up, so. But then that made the x-ray little extra bonus thing at the end very interesting, because we saw the bounties up on them, and she's getting ready to get off the ship, and sneaked at the logs and it's all Naomi, Naomi, Nagata, Nagata, so, or it was, but then now it's getting deleted. There was so much here, uh, I've only, <laughs> I've only been rambling for three minutes now, but there's so much here. I, I really need to let this digest, I need to edit this and let this sink in, because otherwise I'm just gonna ramble on and be even more of an idiot. I'm glad to be back in season six and, uh, trying not to think about the end of the show, that's inevitably coming, but one episode at a time. Thanks again for being here. Hope it was worth your time and I look forward to the next one. See you soon and goodbye.